How long has it been? It's too long. Move up. Right. Let me take care of it for you. Here we are with Marie-Michel Gagnon, a.k.a. Mitch. Mitch is a World Cup slalom skier, GS skier, super combined skier, and, well, skier. Thanks for coming. Thank you. So you're, I would say, a veteran, becoming a veteran on the tour, especially on the team, the Canadian ski team. Yes, I'm the oldest. That's um, a nice yeah. way to put it. <laughs> <laughs> Who did you look up to growing up? Did you have a ski racer admiration? Mike Janik. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, but actually, um, Melanie Turgeon was yeah. one of the, my biggest idol. When I was young, I wasn't really aware of all the racers in the world, but Melanie Turgeon was the biggest star in Quebec, and she was in all of the papers, and I had a poster from her that was signed, and it's, she said, like, have a good season, see you on the team soon or something, and I was no like, way. yes, and she knows. She knows <laughs> I'm coming, and I was super fired up by that. I was like, yeah, yeah. but then... By the time I got on the team, she was retired, but who cares? Yeah. yeah. The, the whole like inspiration thing came from that. Is that something that you are aware of when you're out there on the World Cup inspiring the next generation, young women coming up to race, being that model for them? Sure, I, I, that's, that's what gets me going. And like, I'm involved with this, the kids in my hometown. So we do like a run in the mud every summer. And um, yeah, I, I love that stuff. I want to inspire them, not only to ski, but also to be active the best lifestyle yeah. like you need that to stay healthy and going for a run for like an hour in the morning before work like just gives you the energy for the rest of the day and I just want to help kids but even maybe adults kind of finding the right routine because it's the best <laughs> what are you at what uh, level are you right at? now well I'm doing an interview so I'm oh. not really <laughs> you know spinning that hard but uh normally we try to go I think it's like 120 watts for yeah. recovery but and then we do little, <laughs> no, I'm 135 then. Oh, okay. <laughs> Obviously, it's uh, challenging, to say the least, to keep your fitness up as you're traveling so much through the season. Do you find it difficult that you have to get creative, or is that part of the fun? Yeah, it's part of the fun, and our trainer, Alejo, uh, is from Spain, new guy, and uh, he's just got a lot of energy, and he's really creative, bringing new ideas, and always just doing different things in the training. Uh, we've been playing a lot of games this year, which is really, really fun. Like basketball to volleyball Whoa, to are like... Are you allowed to play games? I'm allowed to play okay, games okay, now. Okay. It's really fun. Also, it helps like with the mood. So if there's like a bad race or a bad performance, then it's like, okay, switch it off, have fun, and then it's like, it's over. Awesome. Well, uh, Marie-Michel Gagnon, Mitch, <laughs> thank you for joining me. And uh, see you on the hill. Yeah, sounds good. See ya.